nice, no? Ano pa ako ito? Ara. Nara. Nara? Ara. So all of this, Nara. Yan, Ara. tuloy tuloy. Ganda. <laughs> This vacation house for sale in Tagaytay. But first, make sure you hit like, click subscribe, and click on the bell so you get notified for whenever we release new YouTube videos. We're on Facebook, so make sure you hit like and see first and follow us on Instagram at presello underscore official. My name is Julia and welcome to another presello open house tour. Medyo na off balance ako ng konti kasi yung kalye may incline. It's actually quite hilly in here and looks really, really nice with the landscape, the hilly nature of the roads and the trees okay so as you go uh, along the road and you see the facade of your house you'll see that this is instantly a modern architecture amidst all of the greenery so this is your front your frontage on the left you have your garage gate and then in the center you have your pedestrian gate so once you enter you will see lots of seating surfaces so this house has a lot of places that you can hang out in we have this corner you have the steps themselves you have this area over here so marami kang pwedeng literal na tatambayan on this side of the house see if you can see <laughs> so you have uh actually a few meters maybe two meters wide na daanan this will lead you to one of your staff quarters also a bit of a zen garden here on the right side and then over here you have more seating this is adorable i don't know i found this really really cute imagine nandiyan yung mga kaibigan mo nag-uusap kayo medyo na ubusan na ng seating spaces dito kaya nakaupo mag-isa ka lang with a tree i don't know i like it okay and then here we have the main entrance but before we go there there's more seating space so you have this, you have this, and then in this area, actually you could turn this into a bonfire if you wanted to, but right now it's a nice little garden. And yeah, another tambay spot, but with a view. So again, you see all of the greenery, the sky, and this is the Gaitai, so it's nice and cool. And then over to this side, quite literally the side of the house, you have extra space, so it's up to you what you want to do with it. You could turn it into a service area, a laundry area, more hangout spaces, like maybe seating in there. So, your call. Okay. Let's now go in. And the first thing that you will notice once you open your wooden door is that it's high ceiling. So you have clerestory windows at the top to let light in. And from there, you'd be able to see your ceiling, which has a lot of interesting design. So you have cove lighting, you have track lights, you have pin lights or down lights, and then you have several uh, leading lines. So this area is different from that area and this area. So your living area, your dining, and then this general pathway from the main stairs to a sort of den. So this one you can turn into an office. So you already have your built-in desk with some storage, some seating, a window, and all of it is enclosed by a glass screen door. Did I just say glass screen? By a glass panel door. 
Right next to it, we have bedroom number one. So you have some built-in storage shelving. You have your bed over here. The bed already is included. And these are memory foam mattresses. So pati yung mga AC, the stuff that you see here, kasama na siya. And then you have an ensuite, toilet, and bath over here. So with an enclosed shower space, water closet, and sink. Okay. So let's head out. From here, you can see your main stairs, but we're not going to go there yet. We'll go here. So dining area, right? You see this huge wooden door. It's actually sliding. It's huge. I don't know. I, I, we're all dwarfed by this door. So when you slide this, you'll be led to your service area. First thing you will see though, on the left, is your guest toilet and bath. Like if, if they needed a toilet and bath, for whatever reason. <laughs> and then here, you have a stainless steel dining area. A staff quarters. So you already have the wardrobe, you, have, you already have the bunk beds. It's also high ceiling. And then again, more of the service area. And then at the end, you have a door with a screen door. The literal screen is really good, it's glass. That will lead you to the side of your house, which you saw earlier. So you can also see the door of the staff room here. Okay, let's go back out into the main area. I'm just going to point this one out. Under the stairs, you have a bit of a zen garden. So you can put some potted plants in there or whatever it is that you want to put in there, but it's, you know, it's a nice accent area. Okay, now before we head up, let's just appreciate all of the lines that we see. And it's in all directions because we have some geometric or modern geometric uh, lines going on from the handrail to the steps themselves, to the accent wood pieces, and even to the handrail, which is floating. Just a friendly reminder though, if you haven't already, if you're enjoying this video, make sure you hit like and click subscribe. And if you need help selling your property, make sure you go to our website and look for the tab, sell my property. Okay, let's head up the second floor. It's interesting how this is wood and this is steel. It's very interesting that when you reach the second floor, you have this nice corridor over here. Nakasara lang kasi yung mga bintana. Okay lang po. <laughs> Nakasara lang kasi, but these are all windows, so may ilaw na pasok dyan. And then you have this secondary main door, almost. And then this is the second floor. Cute, right? It's like, it looks like um, either a large hotel suite or vacation house. So you have here your second living room, lots of light, thanks to the windows. You already have your furniture, you have your built-in shelves already for entertainment. And then check out the ceiling. It's pretty, it's pretty minimalist. It has some wooden slats spaced apart, but it looks so nice and neat. And then it's a contrast to the kitchenette area. So it still has uh, Lines in a similar direction, but it's different. This one's made out of concrete. And it's just visually, it, it's satisfying, right? So living area, kitchenette. You have a stair, a set of stairs in here. <laughs> Those are uh, curtains. And I just want to point this one out. The one, two, three, the fourth step continues all the way to the rest of your entertainment shop. Oh, it's a nice touch. Okay, so let's check out this one first. So at the end of your kitchenette, you have here two doors. This one leads to your common toilet and bath. So you have your water closet, your sink, and behind the door, as you can see it, I think I'm too close to the camera, is an enclosed shower space. All of us are in here. <laughs> and then right next to it, we have bedroom number two. So lots of space. You already have uh, the headboard built into the wall, some shelving, and this gorgeous, gorgeous color. It's a matte blue-green. I don't know if it'll translate well on the camera. It's kind of hard to take a photo of it actually using our phones, but just trust me, it's a beautiful saturated blue-green. 
Again, lots of like very maliwalas. Then you have your built-in wardrobe in this corner. Okay, and then uh, from this perspective, very interesting. And then here on like half a floor up on the right, we have bedroom number three. So again, you have lots of windows here, not set on curtains, I mean blinds. And then this is the amount of space that you have. Your bed space and tables on either side. And then some mid-century furniture or mid-century inspired furniture over here with the TV. This is included and it's so new, it still has plastic. Actually, a lot of the appliances here and stuff here still have plastic. So, it's <laughs> not and across this, we have the master bedroom, which has a walk-in closet, a walk-through closet, as some might like to call it. So full-length mirrors for the doors, solid doors, and then the ensuite, toilet and bath with an enclosed shower space, a sink, water closet, and a jacuzzi, and then mirrors to further expand the space. But it feels even larger because of all the mirrors. And then here is the actual bed area. So you can fit a queen-sized bed. Love the headboard. Again, wooden slats. Flanked by club lights on either side. And then here we have a chase lounge in the corner. Because why not? You've got all of these windows. You might as well have a nice sitting area to read or nap beside your bed. Because why not? <laughs> I'm not I'm not being sarcastic, I legit I appreciate this and then we have a door on the left corner that leads to a balcony this is, okay i can open it so this one is at the facade of your property so you can appreciate your neighborhood which is nice and quiet and full of trees okay all right so that is the second floor and it is now time for a recap. You know, let's let's do it here. Okay. Numbers. You have 360 square meters of floor area and 207 square meters of lot area. Two stories, but you have several layers. Like for this one, for example, on the second floor, you have a half layer up or a mezzanine for the master bedroom and bedroom number two. And then your foyer, or not your foyer, your facade has a ton of layers where you can sit on so literal seating areas and then steps where you can sit on and um, two staff quarters two living rooms a single vehicle garage it's an enclosed garage it's not a car port four bedrooms three toilet and baths and uh, yeah it's already interior designed the appliances that you saw already come with it including the furniture Oh, I forgot to mention, you have guest parking in front, so plenty of guest parking over there. And inclusive of the memory foam mattresses. Because yeah, we appreciate good mattresses here. <laughs> and all of this is in Tagaytay. So if you're anyone you know is interested in a place like this, send this video to them. Or if you want to see it for yourself, send us a message or go to our website at www.presello.com. Invest in your future. Invest with us. Invest with Presello. Hey guys, if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, make sure you click here. And if you want to see more house tour videos, click right here. And we also have this new thing called Working Lunch with Priscilla, where I and a few random people talk about a few random things related to uh, real estate. So if you want to join in on the conversation, make sure you click right here. <laughs>